I've always been curious about how those beautiful fireworks are made. So let's take a look at how they work. First, the outer shell of the firework is usually made from a cardboard tube, which is mainly used to prevent the firework shell from veering off its trajectory. At the bottom of the tube, there's a layer of red clay, which not only enhances the stability of the firework, but also prevents it from getting damp. Above the red clay, there's a layer of gunpowder made from a mix of potassium nitrate and sulfur, which generates thrust to launch the firework shell when it explodes. There's also a fuse inserted into the gunpowder, primarily made of black powder and wrapped in multiple layers of fiber. Now let's take a look at the most crucial part of the firework, the shell. The small pellets inside can be arranged in specific shapes to create the desired patterns. When they explode in the air, in the center of the shell, there's also gunpowder that is used to ignite the explosion in the sky. When you light the fuse of the firework, a large amount of heat and gas is generated to ignite the explosives. The resulting force will launch the firework shell to heights of several hundred meters, while the delay fuse of the shell is also ignited. Once it reaches a certain height, the delay fuse ignites the explosives inside the shell, setting off the surrounding pellets that are arranged in a specific pattern. This is how the fireworks burst into a dazzling array of colors and lights against the dark sky.